the array at method allows you to take an array and then access an element by its index. So this here works in a very similar fashion to the standard array access by square brackets notation. But this one here has a bit of an extra twist which can come in handy. Now before moving on, I just want to quickly mention that this here is relatively new. So watch out for browser support. You can find a link down below to the MDN documentation for um, that support. Um, but if you're using Node.js 16.6, you should be uh, good to go. So this here is an example of using the array at method. We can see here I'm logging out usernames at index one, which should give us new user 91. I'll run this script here and we can see we do indeed get new user 91. This here is relatively straightforward. What happens if I provide an index that is not inside the range of the array? For example, index 20 does not exist. So we can try that we simply get undefined. Now, the special thing about this method here in comparison to the uh, standard access with square brackets is that you get to access by negative index just like in Python. We can say negative one to get the last element. I can run the code again and we get coding man, the last element from the array. You can also say negative two to go back one more. And this one here is gonna give us again, new user 91. So like I said, this is an alternative to the square bracket access using JavaScript arrays. And that is all for this one. If this video helped you out, make sure to drop a like and subscribe to Decode. And here is another video.